Won't let us sleep in the inn, eh? Well, I've got a solution for that. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> So we got comments today, hey? Yeah, Ted, we got three great comments today. Wow, boof. Uh, Trilink533 says, can you bonk a Lionel on the head with a Korok? Please and thank you, thank you bonk for the manners. Okay, cool. I think uh, we should do that. Kendra J. Drawing says, construct a motorcycle out of Zonai devices. Zonai devices. <laughs> That's not how you say it. <laughs> and I think it's basically Tears of the Kingdom's Master Cycle Zero. Oh. So how great is that? No DLC? We'll DLC about that, won't we? <laughs> and finally, the third idea, which is the first that's gonna be in the video, is from Dog Paws, uh, Dog Paw XS. What happens if you block the dragons from entering the depths by covering the chasm hole with something? Will they clip through it? We're gonna find out today and more in this episode. We're gonna have all sorts of fun. Ted, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling pretty good. I'm, uh, I'm already collecting boards for this <sighs> dragon I'm bored. blockage. I'm bored of this. You would be, but too bad. Link is on such a boarding quest. <laughs> Bo the boarding? Nope. Well, it didn't quite work. You can't say boring. <laughs> Although I guess the dragon might be trying to bore through the boards to get into the chasm hole. Oh. I suppose those chasm holes had to be created somehow. But I love the idea of uh, blocking a dragon's flight path, and what better way to do it than to, of course, find the most obvious part <laughs> where you know they're going to go. It's right down the old chasm hole. Now, do you think that that's enough lumber? No, I need to collect more. I'm... Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. We love these ideas that you guys come up with. Uh, oh, oh. All right. Um, we find some of our comments in the YouTube video comments. We find uh, many of the comments uh, that inspire some of these videos in the Discord server. Uh, we have a Discord server, and if you're 13 or older. Or older. Or or with the parents' help. Uh, 13 through 120. Uh, you're welcome to join our Discord and uh, go to the you choose TOTK. Uh, server section area of the Discord, and wait, what are you doing now? You can drop those? Well, I thought there were more boards up here, but I guess I was wrong? They're in the same place that they always are. Duh, uh... I like how you're trying really, really hard <laughs> to make some sort of argument that makes your mistakes look better, but That's there's exactly nothing you what can I'm doing. There's nothing you can say. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna go. Darlings. We're gonna go to Central High Rule, and I'm gonna create a blocking mechanism, and then fly it over. And then, uh, then we're just gonna auto build it. Oh, yeah. Do you have enough Zone A points to do that? Uh, we have Zone Eight. <laughs> Cap that just goes on top. <laughs> Giant pot lid over the hole, but it's gonna have to be really big, though. Dude, the basement's biggest pot lid. Gritlock <laughs> returns. <laughs> Gritlock. Returns after seven years. It's the pot lid in this episode of Tears oh of the Kingdom. Oh my gosh, I just slept to get rid of rain. Ew. Yeah. I hate I hate the rain. I want I want Nintendo. You should have had like an end game item that could just make it stop raining. Because yeah. at that point, you don't like the only thing about rain is that it's annoying now. Right. Or <laughs> I it mean, could undo or negate the negative aspects of rain um, mechanically, but also just the look of it. Like, I don't know, as a YouTube channel, you don't want, you don't want rainy videos. Yeah. Yeah, it's like raining on our parade over here. And like, if I do color correction to a video, Ooh. I don't want to have to like, I should just change it for sun and rain. Yeah, just do those two. Yeah. Here, I'm going to bring this over though, to conserve, we're just going to bring this over to another set here and do some other big ones to it. To conserve a little bit more of our zonite. Well, I think that's a fine idea. In theory. If zonite were a real thing. Everybody knows it's called zonabe. Hey, there's a... B Wait, did you add a B? <laughs> Listen, if you can take away three letters at the end of it, I can add anything I want. Well, that's a compelling and rich uh, opinion. How are you going to stick that to this in a way that makes any kind of sense? Oh. Like such. Like such. Did you guys know you can just uh, shake the controller? 
I found that out when you did it recently. And to I was make like, it oh, like that's no. so better. Wait, I think you knew I, I think you knew that a while ago. I think we talked about it a while ago. But we were using this the, is gonna have to be pretty big, I think, because like the hole is big. Yeah. Well, I mean we could start out but like you could just make a big X over it instead of cover the entire thing. Oh and yeah. And maybe the dragon would be like a glorp <laughs> off to the side and like squeeze through one of the quarters. That's true. All right, so we have this in our history now. We should. Yeah, we do. So now I'm gonna war his two ones in the middle of killing a choo choo. It, yeah, you're looking right at it. I know. I'm. I'm considering though. It's where the green pin is on the mini map. I put that there helpfully last the time. The dragon's on its way here. So if I hurry, so if I'm fast. Uh oh. You this got is no be tool close. though, and you can't climb. I don't need. I don't need that. You know why? Because I have a sense of direction. And I don't get distracted by every apple. It's a race. It's a race to the finish. Uh, Ted? I purchased... What? Oh, no, we're good. I purchased Spy Hunt... Oh, damn it! Oh, not Ultra Hand. Recall. It would have frozen it. <gasps> I got it! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, I bought Spy Hunter for the NES uh, in Duluth last week. <gasps> cool! For $4.99. How do you find these stores that have cool stuff? I am magic. I guess. But about Spy Hunter? About Solar Jetman? Ooh, that's a good one, too. And, unfortunately. I bought Animaniacs for the Super Nintendo, which was not a great game, but I remember renting it as a kid and wanting to like it and getting kind of far-ish, but not being able to... Is this going to flip you in? Whoa! Oh, come on! Recall! That's Fuse! Got it! Did it again. <laughs> Dragon? No, we're okay still. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's hard. There's not space. Yeah, like, yeah. it won't let me put it places. Okay, will this even make it across? <laughs> what the heck? I did not stink and do that. I think it made you let go when, like. <sighs> it's gone now. Yeah. Darn it. it. Is. Ah! <laughs> stupid. Okay. Why did it let make me let go? That was so stupid. I liked it. Oh, because I climbed onto it? Yeah. Shouldn't have let me climb onto it. Yeah, well, yeah. If you're already um, holding it. Yeah. Ultra handing something, you shouldn't be able to climb on top of it. <laughs> Make sure it's in there. It is. It's not. It is. It's not. Yeah. It is. <laughs> <laughs> well, Peter, that was like a roller coaster of emotion right there. Yeah, what? Well, yeah. Okay. It's like an elevator, a very fast elevator of emotion. <laughs> There, now it won't fall. Okay, it takes 12. We've got 43 left. Now we're down to 31. So we can do that two more times. So hopefully this reaches across. It should. It, it looked like it was going to until I climbed onto it. <laughs> it's so long, it's hard to yeah. make it do stuff. Okay, are you going to... Fall? Nope. No. Okay. Ooh. All right. Oh, it's not. Oh man. Uh, okay. well, maybe turn it this way and put it over by those trees on the left. Okay, I'm just gonna add another one. Oh, we don't have enough for six though. Come on, game. Come on, game. <laughs> Run, Link. <laughs> you almost got smushed. Oh, no. Oh, this looks maddening. Like. Uh, uh, come on. You stinking. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> Okay. 
Tool and save me from the bees. <laughs> oh my gosh! This, is... this better be long enough now. Oh, oh, oh! Why? Why are you spinning? <laughs> You spin me right round, Bordy, right round. Okay, did I get it? Now you could make two more and glue them onto there at 90 degrees. Like I think we're just gonna try to block it with one for now. <laughs> Here she comes! Dude, she's gonna go right past it. Okay, do you wanna save? Oh, will this stuff say stay here? Probably not, but we're going to see what happens. I have this long one in my inventory now, too, so we can get some more zonite. And <laughs> this is not a great angle. I'm just going to go over here and see. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, we want to be able to see, like, down at the hole. Oh, I really hope it's... In the right spot? I mean, the dragon's big enough that it should hit this. But this would be a better angle here. Well, you can move the board, can't you? Or... It's just gonna fall. Oh, it's not. We don't have enough zonite. I could have made another one right now. Doing that. Right. He hadn't used up all the zone. I didn't use oh, it up. Oh, 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 oh! We're gonna have our answer. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna miss the whole thing! <laughs> oh, no! Well, well. Oh, 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 oh. here comes the hands. Ooh. What? The hands wow. phase through. I can't believe the body would phase through, though. Yeah, I mean, Whoa. we're really close to blocking it. <laughs> Dude, you saved, so you could load and just move the... The board dragon would be in the bit. same spot, right? And then just move the board over a little bit. <laughs> what am I hitting? <laughs> Tree branches, maybe? I think you're running into your own hubris. <gasps> that was almost a repeat. <laughs> Whoa, no, okay. We're okay now. All right. We're good. We're good. It's so boingy. Okay, when does the dragon fly into here? 1 p.m.? It's coming. It's on its way. That's right smack <laughs> dab in the middle now. What All are right, you doing dragon. about that, Nadra? Yeah, what you gonna do now? Huh? Bet you didn't, didn't think of this. Nintendo developers. What are you doing now? You gonna make a fire? You gonna put a board, a blog in the middle just of just it? Just make it a little bit more, you know. Corporeal. What if that caused the whole bridge to fall in? I would be really upset. <laughs> <laughs> but I'd have no one to blame except myself. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you'd find a way. Okay. <laughs> Get ready to eat log. <laughs> <laughs> Even if it misses the log, it's definitely hitting the bridge. This dragon versus this <laughs> bridge. What will happen? We know the legs phase through it. It'd be super cool if... Oh, moment of truth! I mean, almost anything would be cool. Ah... Uh... Whoa! Oh, oh, it oh, broke it! Broke it broke through! <laughs> wow! <laughs> that was awesome! It was really fighting for its life there, though. Okay, next is a Master Cycle Zero using Zonai ingredients. What do we have? We've got, um... Wheels. Yep. We have no stabilizers. Ooh. So we gotta go find ourselves one. And we... Well... How are we gonna find a state? I mean... We don't have anything to purchase them with. We need to defeat some guys. Because we don't have anything to put into those vending machines. Do we have any large Zonite? I don't think... Oh, well, we have some small We do ones. have things to put into the vending machines. We just got to find the, the vending machine that sells the stabilizers. Nope. Ba -ba -ba. Stabilizer locations. Okay, here we go. Inside of Starview Island. Okay. A giant sphere floating in the Gerudo <laughs> Highland sky. Found him. Next to Ook. Kujisi Shrine. I found it. In West Nicl Hey. Core. There's one right here. Just south of Kakariko Village. On the cliff behind the general store. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I was as fast as your favorite search engine. Maybe even a little faster. Well, don't blame the search engine. Blame the user. T they don't they don't edit? 
Wow, this IGN tab is using 2.4 gigabytes of memory. Close. Gigabytes? That's what it said, 2.4 G. Meanwhile, our uh, email address is using 296 megabytes. Dude, that's why everything's got to get so powerful. Well, you can make a lopsided. <laughs> I mean, I suppose. You gotta. Good. Get the Master Cycle Zero in Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> well, it's a little bit tippy. I know. Turn it on. <laughs> oh, wait. I gotta get on it, though. Yeah, you could have just grabbed the... Yeah! We got our motorcycle back! <laughs> no DLC. It's kind of cool, though. The wheels, like, independently turn a little bit. Yeah, it's a, it's an articulated Master Cycle Zero. Although the body is rigid. Like some people I know. <laughs> oh, I gotta check this message just in case everything is not okay. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm just gonna chuckle at Ted driving into the wall. <laughs> Ted. Oh, it's my wife texting me about consequential or inconsequential? Inc inconsequential, but also good news. So we're good. Ted's wife. We look at we did it, guys. The Master Cycle Zero. <laughs> <laughs> it's not quite fast enough, though. Oh, you oh, know, look at that. What would make it faster? Well, we got a couple options. Wait, it's still standing upright. Rocket. That's we cool. We could shoot fire out the back. Uh, I'm Let's thinking do a little both. bit of both. Yeah, <laughs> and so we need the rocket to not be the thing that's holding the flame. Ah, uh, yes, that's true. Because the rocket disappears. Let's go off a jump. Master Cycle Zero, baby! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it slowed down so much at the end. Yeah, it'd be nice if it just kept its momentum. But should have. It was oh going well. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Remember nature. <laughs> Pepperidge remember Farm how much remembers. we love that? <laughs> Pepperidge Farm remembers. <laughs> <laughs> well, take that, Hyrule. That's what you get. All right, Ted, you got five minutes to boop a Lionel with the Korok. Easy breezy. What we lack for Zone, we make up for with honeyed apples and buttered apples and fortified pumpkins. Oh, I could eat a fortified pumpkin. Doesn't that sound good? It does, yeah, pumpkin sounds really delicious right now. Oh yeah, Ted mentioned a meat, uh, meat stuffed pumpkin, in, in, in last episode. In a previous Tell the episode. story. Yeah, so <clears throat> once upon a time, uh, some roommates and friends of mine and I. You were in college at the time, right? Yes, we were in college. We are, uh, and we were uh, frequent attenders of a church that had potlucks, and we always wanted to bring something fun to the potluck. So one time we brought a five gallon bucket of jello we did buy a new bucket and we did fill it it took like two weeks in the to fridge set. to harden oh and we had to take God. a bunch of shelves out of the fridge so we had really diminished refrigerator <laughs> you guys are so space. like committed to these we were committed uh but the meat stuffed pumpkin is uh so we, we bought a pumpkin and we cut the top off like you do with a jack-o'-lantern and then we scraped out the insides removed all the seeds and pulp like you do with a jack-o'-lantern uh, and then we put the top back on, and then we we got a drill bit the size of approximately the size of a cooked hot dog, and <laughs> drilled holes in the pumpkin all around. So it's a polka dot pumpkin. Uh, and then we cooked hot dogs and stuffed the cut hot dogs into the holes to plug the pumpkin, and then we filled the inside of the pumpkin with baked beans, <laughs> cooked baked, baked beans. beans. <laughs> so then the idea, and then, and then we bought a bunch of buns, and then we brought this whole monstrosity warm to the church potluck. Like, I don't even think we attended church, because we were preparing the... <laughs> Too busy preparing the <laughs> meat-stuffed pumpkin. Yeah, so then what you did, we put, set out a little instruction card, is you picked up a bun, and uh, you held your plate under a hot dog sticking out of the pumpkin, preferably the topmost pumpkin, or a hot dog. And then you grabbed the dog with the bun and pulled it out and held your plate in place so that the beans would ooze out of the hot dog hole on your plate. <laughs> Did it work? <laughs> sort of. I was going to say the beans, I feel like, probably didn't have enough upward pressure to really... Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, they gravity assisted. We had to put a lot of beans in there, and most of the holes were drilled low. But the hot dogs were a little droopy, you know? So they looked like um, like the hair of like a <laughs> Snoopy comic character. Like that, a like dreadlock. Those, yeah. 
<laughs> Dreadlock pumpkin. And uh, my wife thinks that this story is so funny that uh, like a year ago when our current <laughs> stuffy old people Lutheran church, it's not that bad, but some some folks are pretty old school. And you'll recognize why, or you'll recognize that that's true when I say that we, <laughs> uh, they had submissions for a recipe book that they invited people to do, and we submitted the hot dog pumpkin, and it made it into the recipe book. No way! <laughs> so a bunch of old really? Lutherans have recipe books that include the hot dog pumpkin recipe right now. <laughs> and we got a copy for ourselves so we could chuckle at it. Uh, we should make that for an episode sometime. It's, yeah. I mean... And then we're Maybe just like a Halloween for like, special. That sounds like a nightmare meal. <laughs> we're just waiting for someone to notice it and like say something to us because <laughs> our names are on it, you know? <laughs> like, did, what's the deal with the hot dog pumpkin <laughs> recipe in the recipe book? <laughs> All right. Oh, you know. We got to get this guy over to a Lionel. It's an old college favorite. All right, which, uh, where are we near? Do you want to drop a pin where the nearest Lionel is? I don't need to drop a pin. I know where he is. If I say podcast enough, will YouTube categorize this video as a podcast? No. Maybe if we say a P.O. But oh, oh, wow. <laughs> I think you need a rocket. We're out of rockets. We don't have any good stuff because we only play this file when we're recording things. Yeah. Why is it lean so hard to the side? Oh, my <laughs> gosh. I'm so tired of where they put all the enemies and stuff in this game. What's wrong with it? They're just always everywhere you don't want them to be. Like a bad neighbor. <laughs> wow, Link's really laying waste. See, I wonder why we're always out of good stuff. Because I'm so fed up. <laughs> <laughs> why is he on fire? Oh, because he struck the fire fruit in his backpack. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I had it. All right, if you want to see us try some other no, ideas. No, we got to boop the Lionel. Oh, okay. We, we promised it. <laughs> Stupid. Oh, I'll edit out the boring bits, but I'll uh, I'll make sure that that bit plays twice. That is so dumb. I hate these bokoblins. <laughs> We're making progress. <laughs> Still more efficient than the United States government. <laughs> well, the good news is we got the the Korok over to the Lionel. The bad news is we're in debt 1.4 billion Zonite to the Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> I need to reach my friend. Bad you news. You need to shut your mouth. <laughs> You're not gonna. That was on purpose. I figured when you weren't like, oh no! All right, we're off the map, but we're coming in on the home stretch here in the Akala Parade Ground Ruins. I used to have parades here. I found that if I kind of like angle this machine just a little <laughs> bit like this, it just goes periodically... that way. <laughs> yeah, we're making decent distance now. <laughs> this is definitely the most sophisticated way to bring a Korok to a Lionel. Oh, yeah. Break here. Let the batteries recharge. That's not a bad idea. You don't want them to go out when you're over the water. Oh, there's a bridge. You need to reach your friend? Shut up. I know which friend you need to reach. Yeah. I'm gonna eat some meals though, so this Octorok doesn't kill me. Big stabby friend. No. <laughs> Left. This thing handles worse than a Subaru. What kind of car do you drive? Comment below. Unless it's a Subaru. Then downvote the video. Gosh, what if our whole audience is Subaru drivers? <laughs> we have to start over. Oh! <laughs> I 
Oh yeah, grab it from there with the Ultra Hand. Oh. Don't you dare. There, there. Oh. <laughs> Stop laughing at me! It's funny! It's funny! Lionel's right over there. It's gonna be nice and rainy when we film this, finally. Everybody loves that. <laughs> I know we do. There he is. There he is, folks. There's Lionel. This Lionel. He's a privileged Lionel. Not every day a Lionel gets to get booped by a Korok. Hey, what the? Uh-oh. Well, I'm glad he got out his sword instead of his bow. Wait, what are you doing? I thought you were going to disconnect. Uh-oh. <laughs> Do we have any fairies? Maybe. All right, hold still, you. <laughs> no! <laughs> well, we were close. I'm not trying that again. If you want to see us try again, comment below. Uh, there's a fun video on the screen right now. Ted gets real frustrated in that one. And if you click on it, we'll meet you over there. In the basement. <laughs> <laughs>